today Friday 12th of January short update for Nasdaq and today we have got the PPI data it was improving a little bit a little bit better than expected so now matter on coming Monday is holiday and means we will have also Nasdaq trading but uh, it will be so tight and therefore for day traders it would be an amazing day strategy strategy number one is if they gonna hold through the holiday and for Tuesday open they should uh, be considering on the open price of today where the price will end and uh, the second strategy will be then to cruise the positions no matter losses or winners while I didn't want to mention that on the mines but I did uh, so as I said I'm not going anymore to tell the exact entries and opens because there are scams on the chats of trading view that are using my signals and uh, selling them on the internet so therefore why should I give them the possibility to make money I don't want it so but if you want it so I called the accounts yesterday you need to report the moderators to get them away and then if I see it happening I will again tell the exact signals whatever the yesterday's uh, market uh, move was excellent and uh, the result was that we have an outside day and that outside day is typically bearish but the market does not um, has not discounted it so today for this Friday um, we have a bullish day in front of us meaning that the market the bulls first of all has shown the card at around um, 16,810 to 20 and on the other side the bears that we've been waiting for the bears and we know now exactly where the bears are waiting to re-attack a little bit higher so but below 16,900 and at this moment they are going now um, to fight this zone uh, this is a special zone as you can see also from the price chart for the swing traders it would be very attractive to buy and uh, for the bears they shall wait the market to get higher but if uh, you are bearish um, you should be aware of fake breakouts or going through breakouts um, that would uh, damage the bears so um, I had today some Fed members will talk today anyway at this moment as we can see now the market's coming down a little bit you know, 16,807 16, so that's a defense zone or a big fight zone I won't buy this zone so at this moment and uh, wait for the price to leave that area all right have a good day